Gusto mo ba ng data entry jobs? Magaling ka ba sa pag encode at proficient sa paggamit ng Google Suite apps? Well, another company is hiring. Kaya, if you are interested to apply, panoorin ang video ito. I'm Kaz, and welcome back to our channel. I'm a social media VA. Dito, magahanting tayo at magbibigay ako ng mga ideya where to find side hustle, home-based jobs, tips, at tools, at lahat-lahat na nalalaman ko based on my experience as a VA. Kaya, if you like this kind of video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and click the notification bell para lagi kayong updated. Now, the company is Luna Outsourcing. They started on September 2018, kaya super legit ang company ito dahil hanggang ngayon is nagbibigay pa rin sila ng trabaho sa kapwa nating Pilipino. So, the requirements that you need to have, you should have stable internet connection, of an equipment like a laptop or a desktop computer, and a headset. Also, you need to be self-motivated and attention to detail. So, what is a data entry job? So, according to Flex Jobs, data entry is the process of entering information or updating records in a database or computer system. So, what does a data entry clerk do? Data entry professionals use computers and data processing programs to input information. So, data entry jobs may also include transcribing data from recordings or phone conversations, while most data entry duties are handled electronically, paper documentation may be used as well depending on the employer. So, if you are a data entry VA, so usually ang gagawin mo is um, may mga files na ibibigay sa iyo si client and then i-encode mo ito sa kanilang um, tool or software na um, ginagamit. In my case, kasi may data entry uh, position or responsibility din akong ginagawa, um, like for example, um, yung mga product ay ini-input ko sa tool na ginagamit namin. So, later on, isi-share ko sa inyo yung mga process or ano yung ginagawa ko as data entry VA. Now, here are the other positions na meron sila or they are available na pwede din yung applyan aside from data entry. Um, they also have Amazon support, bookkeeping, cold calling, content creation, copywriting, customer support, data mining, data entry, executive assistant, graphic design, lead generation, project management, social media management, virtual receptionist. So, dito mga hunters, um, there are full-time and part-time available. So, if gusto nyo ng full-time, then you can choose the full-time position. If part-time naman, then you can also ask them na magpa-part-time lang kayo. So, the salary here ranges from 40000 to 50000 per month. So, depending on the position na ina-applyan ninyo. So, ito yung isang client ko. It's a direct client. So, ang ginagawa ko dito is admin task, social media, at the same time, meron din akong data entry na task. So, ito yung um, tool na ginagamit nila. So, ang ginagawa ko is... Um, ini-input ko dito sa service notes kasi yung business nila is a salon tapos itong mga uh, months dito bali ito yung mga um, time in at saka ito yung uh, mga ginagawa ng kanilang mga stylist 
every day. So, si stylist, dapat um, nire-record nila yung uh, sino yung clients nila, kailan, um, kailan pumunta sa salon, at saka itong mga number of lashes na nila, ginagawa nila. Kasi, usually, yung mga stylist nila is naglalagay ng mga lashes. So, yun. Just a little overview or background kung ano yung business. So, dito, um, you will see different um, names ng mga stylist. Tapos, ito yung tool. So, dito din mag, mag uh, lalagay. So, let's uh, click the appointments. So, check ko yung appointments. And then, ang ginagawa ko, okay, as you can see, uh, March 9 today, so, ito yung mga stylist, and then, i-click natin yan. Okay, so, dito, makikita on the other side, yung three service notes. Okay, so, 3.9 vol volume full, full set. So, my instructions si client kung ano yung uh, ilalagay ko. So, i-input ko dito, uh, uh, ang name is si Hannah pala. So, let's find, I'm sorry, it's not Hana. Let's find, uh, ang stylist is si Abigail. So, let's find Abigail. Okay, as you can see, madami ding uh, mga clients si Abigail. So, ang date is March 9. So, ilagay natin dito. Okay, so name ni client. So, sino yung client? The client is Hana. Hana H. H yun? Let me see. Okay, Hannah H. And then... Ay, let's close Courtney. Okay, so it's March 9. And then dito, date of service note, kailan ginawa ni... Abigail yung service note. So, still the same on that day, ginawa ni Abby yung service note. And then, dito is format of service. So, my instruction si client kung ano yung, um, ano yung good at saka ano yung hindi good or bad. Okay, so dapat my full set specific. Okay, so ganyan. So, lag lagyan ko ng good. Okay, dito naman, si other side, number of lashes. Okay, kita ba natin dito yung number of lashes? Tapos, dito naman is stylist comments. Kung may comments. So, for example, dito, 222-2004. Okay, I don't think it's from the lash extension. She moved her leg. So, yan yung, uh, yung ibig sabihin ng comments. So, yun. So, after that... Okay, so, iba naman, ganyan. So, isa-isahin ko yan. Tapos, kung sino yung stylist. So, so si Abigail, my 1, 2, 3, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 appointments. 6 clients sa uh, March 9. So, dapat may pakikita ditong March 9 na 6 clients din. So, the same sa lahat ng mga stylist. So, yun lang. Super easy lang gawin yung data entry ko dito sa client na ito. So, isa-isahin mo lang. Make sure, na, make sure din na updated. So, ang ina-ask ni client sa akin dapat is updated. So, for the week. As you can see, um, March 8 yung um, last ko kasi March 10 today. So, yung working hours ko ni client is from Monday to Friday. So, just 2 hours. And then, yung grade ko dito is $5. So, as you can see, for 5 days, kasi nga 2 hours lang yung working hours ko ni client. So, I got 3500 sa kanya. So, diba, super easy lang gawin yung task. My 3-5 ka na in just one, uh, one 
week for just 2 hours per day. So aside from this, meron naman akong ginagawa na social media at saka sa um, other admin tasks niya. So yun lang. So, depende lang yung um, data entry na pinapagawa ni client sa niya. So, sa akin is super easy lang. So, if you are interested to apply dito sa Luna, then you need to have your resume ready. Make sure na it's updated. Also, um, you should highlight all the skills specially related sa position na ina-applyan niyo. And then, submit it to this link, HR support at lunaoutsourcing.net and then you need also to um, have it titled virtual okay, make sure na if a follow ninyo ang um, instruction na ito para mapili kayo. So virtual and then you need also to have your cover letter indicating um, your interest and then ano yung magagawa ninyo sa position na ina-applyan ninyo. Alright, so that's it mga hunter. This is another company na nagbibigay sa atin na maraming opportunities. At kung mapapasok na kayo dito, pag-igihan ninyo na magkaroon pa kayo ng higher salary. So, if you like this kind of video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and click the notification bell para lagi kayong updated. Also, follow my Facebook page. At saka TikTok account for more updates. Thank you for always watching and happy hunting!